Just finished our last fixtures before Christmas. I'm gonna pick up Roy and see what it's like around the Christmas time. See if he's got that Christmas cheer. Oh, what's happening? <laughs> All Roy! Right. What's happening? How the devil are you? You don't mean to argue with fans of you? No. No. <laughs> no drunk fans around. Oh, you got me a present? Where is it? What's this? Can I, can I have a look? Let's come on, let's have a look. Let's have a look at this. <laughs> this is a great read. What have we got? What have we got? A, a special message for you. What is this, Roy? The second half. Yeah. With Roddy Doyle. Best. Nope. <laughs> bestseller. Number one bestseller. Yeah. Deary, deary me. Oh my, to Micah. Who burst on the scene. <laughs> Question mark. There's a question mark like that. Where's my present? You got me a nice watch. I thought you got me a watch. Patek. All right, yeah. Let me take my jacket off. Lovely. I'll leave your present in here, will I? <laughs> you idiot. I knew you were up to something. I knew it. There's something in the uh, central console for you, mate. Have a look. So you did get me something. I wasn't going to leave you out, was I? Mm. Oh, Micah, come on. You egg. <laughs> what age are you? <laughs> Look at this. Oh, I don't it's Christmas, Ryan. Right? That it's Christmas cheer. Look at it. You've got, you got to put it on, mate. <laughs> come on. Where are we going? <laughs> what size is that? Come on. Let's go. I'm going to take this off. So, come on, then. It's Christmas. What do you normally do on Christmas? Relax. Walk the dogs. Walk the dogs. Watch a bit of TV. Only fools and horses. You watch yeah, that? yeah. So, you yeah, know, I've actually it's... never seen it. I've ne I've ne I know. I know it sounds ridiculous. I've never watched an episode of Only Fools and Horses. I'm yeah, going to say that's the most amazing thing I've ever heard in my life. <laughs> You've never seen. Oh, it's brilliant. I, no, no. What's your favourite scene then? Well, everyone goes on about when Del Boy falls on the. I've seen. Yeah, that. you must have seen that. I've of seen course, that. you've seen that clip, which is uh, iconic and brilliant. Okay then, Roy. Come on, Christmas films. The best well, film no, of all you, time. Well, you said the last time your favourite is Home Alone. Home isn't Alone, it? Yeah. mate. Unbelievable. No, my my favourite movie. Going back as a child. It's a Wonderful Life. You have to have. You've seen that. I'm not seen that. What age are you? I forget what it. Honestly, I'm, what... I'm 33. I don't, everyone thinks I'm about 45. But every time I say something to you, you're like, no, you've never heard of it. As if as if I'm a hundred. <laughs> Home Alone, don't you remember? Yeah, you, I know. Who's Home Alone? He's good. With Marv. It's don't brilliant. worry, Harry. I'll get him. <laughs> right in the stairs. <laughs> <laughs> no, it is. No. Put it this way, when that's on, you have to watch it, isn't it? It's one of them movies. Unbelievable. All right, let's talk about United. I joked on Sky saying give it Roy to the end of the season. Why would that not, be a joke? Not a joke, because, like, but you said there's something about me falling up here. But that's what managers do. You're, you're yeah, meant to I fall don't, up. Of course I do. Of course I do. But but you, I'll ask you a couple of questions here. Yeah, go I'm on. Gonna, I'm going to turn it on you. Have you ever been in a dressing room with me? No. As a player? No. Have you ever been in a dressing room with me as when I've been a manager? No. So what, what, why jump to these conclusions that, Roy, a manager, you're, you're meant to challenge people. You're meant to challenge. You're meant to follow up with people. I follow. Managers do that. Now you might go, you can't follow up with everyone. Obviously not. But there's no doubt in my mind, I don't mean Man United. If I went into a dressing room, I've managed in the Premier League. It's not, I've worked at Matt, with Matt and Neely International. I've seen you put that in a couple of games where you've made. We'll have to fight my corner, nobody else is. I always fight your corner. No, I imagine if Roy went in there. No, no, no. Why, no, was no. That, why is that funny? No, you, the, the reason why it was funny is because of De Gea and Maguire. That's right. it. Not because of the rest right. of the team. So the first thing, be because... the, the, but the first thing you'd walk into the club, I'd pull them two and go, I've been really critical of the two. Prove me wrong. Yes, yes, yes. And that's the end of the conversation. If they get upset with it going, no problem, players are upset all the time. And it's not about the players liking the manager. The most important thing is what you hope the players respect the manager. But why, why, why are you not getting these opportunities to go uh, to Man United? Yeah, then? Well, that, that, of, that is a bigger question. Well, obviously, you know, I'm not going to get the United job. Why, why, exactly, but why are you not? Why, why are you not? This is this is the whole conversation. They why are you not going to get they, the United they job? They can't afford. <laughs> What about Christmas when you was winning but I, Yeah, but I love, I love the discipline of Christmas. You know, people say, you know, when you're a player, you obviously train on Christmas Day and you're travelling, you might have a game. I know you, I call it St. Stephen's Day. But I loved all, I loved the discipline of focusing on the matches because, as you know, what, the games over Christmas and are huge, such a huge effect. So quick games, 
I used to love all that. Like, training on Christmas Day, the discipline involved in it. What about Christmas parties? You must have some oh, stories, yeah. Christmas parties. Yeah, yeah. I Listen, I loved it when I was a player. Forest or United would be that fancy dress, you book private rooms, a bit chaos everywhere. No, I loved this and I'd be in the middle of it. I loved all that, but now you get a bit older. I, I wouldn't be bothered organising a, a, a Christmas function. Listen, if there's a function with Sky or something, yeah, of course I'll go. But I'm, I'm not. Should so we organise one? Let's organise one. I did, in, let's go hail in Manchester. I, I, I wouldn't be organising. But there was a meal organised a couple of months ago and you never turned up. I turned up? What are you talking about? No, it was me, you. No, 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 me, not, you, not that one. Me, you, we went out for one. No, yeah, but, not, not that one. There was one end of season and you never. there was only about six of us there. What happened to you that night? You do remember. I No, because it was a late shout, wasn't it? it was All right, yeah, and I got a late shout. But what you do is you adapt. There's a fellow I know really well. He'd ring me, go, do you want a cup of tea or a coffee? And I go, yeah, yeah. And I says, when do you want to meet? And he'll say, I'll meet you like on um, the 5th of February. And I'm going, man, I'm out in a half an hour. I could be dead in six weeks. No, I'm not make, making any arrangements to meet somebody in six weeks for a cup of tea. I'm coming round to yours on Christmas, mate. No problem. That's fine. <laughs> yeah, right. Imagine I turned up with a buzzer. No problem, Mika. You'd be like, no problem. what the you doing I'll have there? the dogs waiting for you. <laughs> Go on, kill. <laughs> you put up the Christmas tree? No, no, my wife does it. So what, so what do you do? I'm there, I'm in the background, you know. Just, just keeping what? everything together. <laughs> I'm doing very little but, but, with but, what, what do you mean? What's there just as a present? It's a bit like when you were playing, you were there. You were doing very little, but you were there. That's like me in the house. So what about the title contenders, do you think? Who, who's best equipped to deal with the Christmas period? I remember we done a game last year and I kind of, I didn't write off Man City. I remember saying, I think Man City lost their, I think I might have used the word, their mojo. Yes. And then they won the league. It was like a doddle to them. Obviously, I know they put in the hard work, but they won at United for the second, but United were never going to kind of catch them. I'd never bet against Man City now. I just kind of learned my lesson from last year. Doesn't mean to say Liverpool and Chelsea can't pip them to the title, of course. But I think Pep's the man. When I look at all the managers, I think Pep You think is, he's the best? I do. If you look at Pep's CV, even, I know people always draw back, well, he's got the best players. He do, you still have to manage him. You still have to manage players. You still have to find a style of play. And if you were going to pick a team to watch, it's going to be Man City, wouldn't it? Let's move on to the uh, the chasing pack. Brilliant. You've got the West Ham's. Brilliant. The Spurs. The Arsenal. Spurs. I, go easy on Spurs. You know, honestly, I, I, you're suggesting Spurs are, what, a threat to the top four? Well, well this, is what I'm, this is what I'm asking you. I don't know. I like to look at West Ham. I think David Moyes done a brilliant job there. They've got good players, good experienced players, a bit of everything. They've had a little sticky patch. They've got European competition. That can take its demands, obviously, into the new year. I like to look at West Ham. So what about Antonio, though? How much do you rate him? Yeah, I like him, yeah. He's a handful. Not sure about his celebrations and all that. What's up with the celebrations? Uh, <laughs> give us some, uh, some moves, please. Some, give us some what, Irish you dancing now. <laughs> You've been drinking. <laughs> what are you talking about? Give us some moves. I was moving last night. What was you doing? What, what, I, was that at a, I was at a concert last night. What concert? I'm going to tell you the band. If, I, if I, you, I, I, if I you, got a, I probably haven't. No. Let me finish. Go on. Deacon Blue. <laughs> <laughs> Please tell me you've heard of them. Oh, Deacon my. Blue. Deacon Blue, absolutely brilliant. I was watching them last night in Manchester. And yeah, well, I would say I was moving. The, the hips were moving. moving. Wasn't it? Yeah, yeah, moving. yeah, yeah, yeah. My little yeah, shoulder. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah it was good. Saying I was tired this morning. <laughs> I swear. <laughs> no, that was good. No, and I don't mind players celebrating. What was your celebration? What was I, you... I had a little, uh, what do you call it, a half yeah, shake. But... Just, you know what I mean? Just shake. But you used to do all that silly celebration <laughs> for like goals. Like, for what? But not even in a big match. Well, well, well done. I you scored can... last minute uh, to draw an equaliser for, me. against yeah. Everton. An equaliser against Everton, we are home. And, no, yeah. uh, it was away. Yeah. Oh, you're Villa home. Park in the FA Cup. <clears throat> this was the original burst. This is what I was talking about. But you scored. But, but, but that is not my job. My, my job is to defend, so yes. obviously if I score, you gotta give me credit for scoring now. Well, well, how do you? Are you 6'1, 6'2? 6'1, yeah. So you're going for set pieces. I'm thinking there's a good chance. You know, your, your head's pretty big. You're gonna get your head on it. <laughs> <laughs> your head's massive. You're gonna head the odd one, even if you don't wanna head it, the ball's gonna hit your head. Look at how many did Steve Bruce score? Oh, he Bruce, scored yeah, loads, didn't he? Can I, can I tell you why he scored more than you? Go on. 
Because when he went up, mm -hmm. he wanted to head it. No, but that's, you know why? Oh I don't agree God, with that. Mike. Who's it's the midfield? Me, Bex, Scotty. Exactly, Jordan. exactly. And they all Bex, scored goals. One of the best crosses of all time. He must have had decent delivery from set pieces. Joey Barton had a good set piece at Man City. Yeah, well, there you go. So, how many goals have you scored in your career? Probably about 11. That's <laughs> <laughs> like, it's embarrassing, isn't it? <laughs> Is it? How many have you scored? Oh, my career. Have a guess. 40. More? 50? 60? 70? 80? You don't tell me you scored 100 goals. If you scored 100 goals, I think it was, I'm, I'm dropping you off I, right I here. think it was about 94. You don't, you don't think, you know exactly the number. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's 94. That shut you up, hasn't it? Hey. What? That shut you up, you tell me I got about seven. <laughs> Right, let's go back to the Premier League. Spurs, Conte, Kane. What does he do there? Sell him, keep him, build a team around him. Because that's what people want to know, yeah, don't they? Yeah, do you know what? We all, everyone likes Conte, obviously. His CV is brilliant. But again, look at the timing. He's gone in there. Spurs must be a hard job. Must be a hard job. Yeah, but he should have... Do you know, do you know, the, word, you know the word I'm going to use? And I hate using the word, obviously. Imagine the culture at Spurs. Yeah, but you've got so, new you training. Have you ground? seen that documentary? Yes, I've seen the documentary, yeah. When I watched that documentary, and I know it can get edited and all this, I was shocked. In terms of what, though? What was going on at the club? Like, even the players in the dressing room, the medical room, everybody on their phones. They showed a couple of players falling out. It might, it might have been Ali and Dyer. But they're arguing like, like children. They're going, oh, you need to do your job. Like, there was no aggression, there was no... It wasn't real, it wasn't real. Oh, it wasn't, it was like, they were like actors, you know, no emotion behind it. Harry Kane was doing a talk before the games. Oh my God, like, Harry, you need to liven up, man. No, I'm telling you. First of all, if you're gonna have a speech before every game, players are gonna get bored of it. Why do you think you need speeches before matches? And you know when people have a huddle before the match, and there's like 600 staff in there as well, you, you kind of lose what it's about. I think the bus driver was in it, the chef. You're like, I'd be like, you get out of this circle of like, whatever we're doing. <laughs> but Spurs, I sort of, I like Spurs. I have a soft spot for Spurs. So, if you was to get some, the pundits on Sky, some presents, let's let's start with uh, Gary Neville. I know what I'd get him, man. The masks, he shuts up. Why does he talk so much? Gary's all right. He's no, he's right. class Gary, isn't he? But why is he talk? Just he's talk got an opinion about right. everything. But remember, when I played with Gary, Gary was very quiet. He knew his role in the dress room, and that was to keep quiet. <laughs> <laughs> he was a, a fullback. So you said there was yeah. bigger hitters in the dressing oh, room. Oh, listen, yeah, he was a fullback. You know, fullbacks don't say much in the dressing room. You got to know your place. What about Cara? What would you what get Cara for Christmas? Cara? What would you get him for Christmas? A uh, uh, United jersey with Ronaldo on the back. That'd be nice, wouldn't it? Because he's always slagging them off. Cara's class. Cara's yeah, class. Decent, class it? They're they're decent class. football and people. Strong, strong opinion. Yeah. He, know, he knows what he's talking yeah. about. Well, <laughs> wouldn't go that far. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. He's got an opinion, like us all. What about Graham? The gra Graham. Graham the, yeah. He is the boss of the whole group, isn't he's, he? He's a, he's just, he just reminds me of one of them. You know when you're watching the old films and just got the, the Italian guys yeah, like, dressed, yeah, yeah. dressed up to the nines? Yeah. I'd buy him he like a, a, a Ferrari or something. He needs to be in like one of them old school, like a free to way yeah, really? Testarossa sort of look. Because remember, obviously, he played in Italy. I think the Italian he's, lifestyle definitely affected him because he is. He but is he's smart. 68. He's 68. He? And he looks better than, than yeah. most. What about Red now? Um, probably a mirror. <laughs> he drags you on their programme. Why do you go on that? I love it. Like, I had a kilt on. Did you see with the kilt on? Yeah, Sliding. Yeah. Brilliant. Why is that brilliant? <laughs> you lose your credibility. I know your credibility is pretty low. <laughs> you can't get any worse. <laughs> but yeah, you're, you're heading that way. Why do you do that stuff? You it's, know what it is? Do you know, no, I know what it is. Go on. Go on. Tell me. Go on. What, what do you think it is? <laughs> It's all about the Benjamins, baby! <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> okay. Sprouts, <laughs> carrots. Okay, yes. Potatoes. Stuffing. Gravy, stuffing, of course. Do you have the pigs in blankets? Yeah, a little bit, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Mate, I bet about... Do you know what we do? We always know it's Christmas in our house, you know? We have a starter <laughs> on Christmas Day. Or we have a prawn... What's your starter? A prawn cocktail. Oh, it's brilliant, honestly. I love a prawn... Oh, but just at Christmas, <laughs> obviously, we stretch the budget out. We, we stretch the, the budget, budget out. Yeah. So what do I have? Yeah, turkey, chicken, though. The Caribbean households, you gotta get the chicken in there, you know what I mean? Nah, I'm, I'm English, Roy, right, but I'm Caribbean, yeah, you know I what I mean? I'm, I'm Caribbean knocking, twist in I'm there. I'm not knocking you, Jesus, I'm not criticizing your choice of food. You said turkey, but when you said that, I was thinking, you are what you eat. You <laughs> there we go. I knew we'd find a tea room, a tea yeah, room. Yeah, pulling into something now, oh, something right. to eat, oh, you know what I mean? Oh, we splashed out here at a tea room. Are you hungry? I'm starving, mate. <laughs> Can you believe that? You never heard of Deacon Blue. Have you heard of Deacon Blue? Yeah, the yeah, ladies, that's what I mean. The, the, you know the, the mean, ladies have heard of Deacon Blue. Are they good, are they? Brilliant. Yes, I've heard of them. Brilliant. Yeah, she said she's heard of them. They're not very good. <laughs> I know they're not very good. They're brilliant. <laughs> it's no problem. No mugs. No mugs. <laughs> Look at this guy. Oh, is that porridge? Is that a porridge? Oh, yes. Oh, yes, for porridge. Oh, yes, don't, don't, don't worry about it. I'll eat this. It's, it's okay. No problem. Thank you. Whose phone is that? I think it might be mine. <laughs> <laughs> it's yours, isn't it? <laughs> I'll pay for breakfast. Uh, <laughs> right, Roy. We're going to pop out and buy you a Christmas tree. Oh. You ready? Yeah. Come on in. I think the Premier League is the toughest it's ever been done. You think? Oh, yeah. There's no doubt in my mind. It's the toughest league. A lot of teams are the same level. Oh, I just even think the teams near the bottom, like... Who do you think goes down? This is, this is, oh, this is, is, is tough, isn't this it? This is tough for them to talk at the top. And people talk about pressure at the top. I've been there as a player with Forrest. I got relegated with Nottingham Forrest. I got relegated uh, with Villa. And you know what, Mick? The other things you remember when you retire. Forget, forget the trophies. Yeah. Three to go down, let's go for it. I tell you, I'm going to go Norwich. I agree with that. I'm going to say Newcastle. Southampton. Southampton. Yeah, but they're, Southampton, they're a moody mate. team. They, but they can win two or three at home and then lose six or seven. I'm not yeah, sure, mate. Yeah, you're sell, right, Mika, yeah. Sell, selling, selling Ings, mate. I'm going to say uh, between Southampton and Watford. But even Burnley, Burnley, Burnley's points. No, Bur Burnley will be all right. You, but you know, Burnley could be one of them teams where because they've got out of it before, you automatically think, oh, they'll get out of it. And they don't. Are we going to sing some Christmas songs? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I've got one for you. Have you not any self-respect? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, come on, give, give us a little. Oh my come God. on, no, come I'm on, right? No, no, no. Last Christmas, yeah. I gave you my heart, <laughs> but the very next day, yeah, yeah. you gave it away. This year, to save me from tears. Yeah, very, no, 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 I'm not singing. I'm not singing. No. <laughs> come on, right? No, no. What else we got? <laughs> oh, how can I forget? Maybe if you gotta go away. Don't think I could take yeah, it. Yeah, yeah, that's good. Yeah, yeah, it's Stay good. Stay now. That is the best. Oh my god. Who sang that? Is it he's 17? He's 17. Yeah, yeah. Driving home for Christmas, you must know that one. Driving home yeah. for Christmas. <laughs> 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 to sing every song I say, but that is. Come on, bro, you gotta sing one No, for no, it. no, relax. Uh, I is that one? No, I, I don't know. Who that sings that right. one? I you're, you're embarrassing me. I'm, I'm starting to cringe. You stop singing. Why? Christmas. Did anyone ever tell you you can't sing? <laughs> no. What do we have here? Who would want to chop down their own tree? <laughs> I'm serious. Who wants to be in charge of the saw? What's going on here? Are we covered in insurance? <laughs> yeah. I want that one though, that's better. 
Are we not low them ones, the electric one, no? This one. Are you happy with this size? Are you happy with it? What do you want me to start? Come on, let's give it a little chop down, shall we? <laughs> oh! <laughs> Is it? Yeah, are you oh. sure? Look at that strength. <laughs> Is it? Just pull it out. I don't have to pull anything. You just pull it out. That is incredible. Hold it out. <laughs> well, yeah. Be careful with them sharp tools there. Jeez. <laughs> Lovely. I'll pull your hand. Okay, it's coming. Timber! Woo. Yes. Ooh, okay. A bit more, a bit more. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely. Ah, yeah, let's get in there. Oh. Oh. It's the most exercise I've done for about six months. <laughs> That's Look cool. at that! Go on, you carry that back. Absolutely on. fantastic! <laughs> go on. Oh, yeah, there we go. Brilliant. Look at that! Yes. What <laughs> am? Well, I've got this to carry, don't I? No worries. Are you gonna make it? Yeah, there's no point in two of us getting dropped, is there? <laughs> <laughs> Put it through the netter. That's cool. As they call it. Just pull that through there for me, sir. Oh, come on, yeah. pull it, come on, lovely. Is that it? Which room is this going in, Roy? Uh, lovely. Proper. I need oh. jobs going here. <laughs> I'm on a walk in tomorrow, man. <laughs> yeah. I'm job done. You happy? You happy with yeah, you? Yeah, lovely. Just the right size. Yeah? Well done. Do you want to go first? Yeah. Sorry, look. <laughs> 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 careful, well get done. her in. Yeah, Be careful now. You, you, you guide it. You got to guide it. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh. You got on the other side. You can't pull it through. Pull it through. That's it. There go. Careful on the door there. Oh, careful, <laughs> careful door. <laughs> That's it. Are we in? Job done. You enjoyed it. I'm going to work next year. I'll come back next year. No, I'm just doing a bit of exercise. It was good. So I'm tired now, though. Like, would, it be, would, it, go? would it be wrong of me to have a little power nap here now? <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm tired. I actually think this one's better. Well, you I think this one's better than the last one. It's just because Nev didn't get in. Thank God for that. But well, it's the same type of personality in the back in that Christmas tree. It could be Nev in the back. Right, Roy. This is us. We've arrived. Brilliant. Have an amazing Christmas. Cheers. Absolute pleasure, sir. Same to you. Take it easy. Am I taking that out of the car? Yeah, go on. Nice one. Take, Take it with you. Oh. Cheers, all. Oh, listen. Cheers, Mick. Take it easy. Drive carefully. Yeah. Well, that was lovely.